How are you guys doing? Welcome back to another video. Some of you guys might remember fairly recently, I made a video about the Arsenal Classic event. Yeah, pretty much, if you don't remember, Arsenal brought out this really cool, like, classic-style Roblox event. It was called Retro Palooza. I really enjoyed it. It had really awesome-looking classic characters. The maps were really cool. Obviously, they were the old Roblox maps, like Bloxburg, Crossroads, the Chaos Canyon, all of those types of maps. You guys know what they are. And yeah, you could basically collect bricks and unlock really cool characters. So today's video is kind of going to be a part two because I want to show you guys an easter egg inside of the game. It's actually a really good easter egg. Oh and I also wanted to update you guys. I did try playing Roblox Battle, not Roblox Battles like the classic Roblox Battle game and I just want to say guys unfortunately it's incredibly broken. It's kind of shocked me how broken it actually was like I didn't expect it to be that bad. I joined it on my Shark Trick Shots account which obviously is my OG Roblox accounts and I used to play this game back in 2012 and yeah I tried playing it and nothing would work not even the weapons rockets wouldn't blow stuff up anymore the bombs didn't even explode on impact the whole classic Roblox battle game is completely dead which is sad you know anyway guys one cool thing that we are going to be unlocking inside of Arsenal is a character from Roblox battle which I think is amazing I believe this type of character is called like a noob wearing shard armor I remember I had this or at least parts of it well yeah Yes, guys, we are going to be unlocking this inside of Arsenal, which, like I said, is amazing. I'll leave a link to Arsenal down below in this video's description. Like I said, you guys have played this before, so let's go and join a game. So, once you guys load into Arsenal, you want to go over to the Retro Palooza section, and you want to make sure you've got a specific character. The character that you need to have unlocked is this guy, John. Now, I've built everything except for the last thing, which is his leg. So, that's 150. I'm going to go and buy it, and I should be able to build him. So, claim character. There we go. We now have John unlocked. So we're just going to claim this guy. Uh, I think he was. There you go. He's the same price as all of these. So I'll put the total on the screen. I can't be bothered to add it up now. But yes, I now have John unlocked. So we're going to close out of this. We're going to go over to our locker. We're going to click on characters. We need to go and change out to this John guy. Last time I got Retro Horseman. This guy looks awesome, but we're going to choose John. So there you go. This guy is also very cool. He's a classic looking guy. So we're going to go and exit a locker. Next, guys, we need to go on the server browser and we need to find a game mode that is brick battle but we are looking for the crossroads map so hide full servers leave that on yes then we're going to do search servers just wait for it to load in and there you go brick battle that is in the united kingdom that's perfect we are going to go and join this server so straight away guys we're just going to wait for it to load my character's glitching oh there you go now he's okay we're going to go and deploy choose whatever team you want it doesn't really matter and you need to get some kind of rocket launcher because you see this wall just here in the corner well yeah we need to destroy this I've got a slingshot right now, as you can see, which is not really going to help. So if I take out one of these guys, I might be able to get a better weapon. There you go. This is perfect. So the RPG, I think this also works with like the bomb. I think these guys are going to kill me. Oh no. Okay. Yeah. I kind of saw that happening. Let me try and get back there. This should work fine on public servers. To be honest, I haven't actually tried it on here yet, but let's just give it a try. Oh, this guy's also doing it. There you go. So that's what you need to do. You need to destroy it. Then you walk up to this thing. It's like the shards of the character, right? And if you walk into them, you should be able to collect them. So yeah, like I said, guys, you need to destroy this wall. Okay, guys, I joined a private server because I was trying to do this on public and people kept on hacking. As I was saying, I think you might have to be John and you might have to destroy it yourself. I know I was playing in the public match and some random guy destroyed it. I just want to say that might not work. For this to actually work, you might need to do it yourself. So you want to go up to this wall. You guys probably know what you need to do now. Just go and shoot it. It should explode. Bricks are going to fly everywhere. And if you go here and collect this stuff, if you just walk into it, I don't think you need to taunt or anything like that. If you walk into this stuff, it should be working. So as you can see here, we've got the shoulder piece, the sword, and also the helmet. And the cool thing is they're exactly identical as to how they were in the classic Roblox battle game. You can also try knifing it and it should be activated now. So what we're going to do, guys, is press M to back out to the menu. We're going to click on the Retro Palooza logo. Then if we scroll across on the character selection, we should be able to find this guy. And let's see, is he appearing? There he is. I just saw him. Shard. There you go. So that's his name, Shard. And well, to unlock this guy, we are going to need 11,000 bricks, which is a lot. And I've also been told you should collect 11,000 all at the same time and not do it individually. I think there's a glitch where it doesn't work or something or your points expire. So yeah, honestly, I'd recommend just getting 11,000 like all at the same time. Claim some other stuff if you've still got stuff to claim, by the way. But yes, get 11,000 bricks and then you should be able to unlock this guy. He looks awesome. 
awesome. And like I said, guys, it's incredibly accurate to the OG Roblox battle character. So there we have it. That's everything you need to know. Like I said, don't buy the parts individually. Wait until you have 11,000 bricks, then go and buy it. Because if you buy this individually, I think sometimes it might disappear and it might reset itself. If it does disappear, guys, you just want to destroy the brick wall again, then just go and knife the parts. And yeah, it should pop up. So there you go. I thought this was quite a nice Easter egg, so I wanted to make a video about it. Also, Roblox Battle is just so nostalgic to me. So if you enjoyed this video, as always, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank you for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one.